It's a fantastic, amazing lump of blancmange that weighs about a kilo. The human brain has a hundred billion neurons, which makes it the most powerful learning tool in the world. Your entire person is encapsulated in that little blob of blancmange. J.J. Mohan is a senior paediatric neurosurgeon at the John Radcliffe Hospital in Oxford. He's part of an almost hundred strong team of consultants who deal with every conceivable problem of the brain. We are making life and death decisions. One split second decides everything. Each year they perform almost four and a half thousand operations. You're concentrating constantly is it in the right place? Stop any bleeding? So you're already in that mindset of think, 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 think. Cutting edge procedures that carry high risk. It can be a bit like uh, walking on a tightrope in very high winds. You could fall off and die. Their interventions can mean the difference between life and death. You've got to respect the organ. You've got to respect the fact that what you do to it can have huge implications for the patient. Jay's been at the John Radcliffe for nine years. He's dealt with thousands of children's brains and spines, from those approaching adulthood to others not yet born. Imagine if you were preggers in this heat. Man alive. It can't be a lot of fun. Today he's off to the obstetrics unit to see Nicola. She's seven and a half months into an unexpected pregnancy, and there are complications. We went for our 20 week scan, the lady was scanning. She was just really silent the whole time. And then she kept saying, I'm going to have to get my colleague. So I think you know in your heart of hearts, as soon as that happens, it's one of them moments when you just think, oh my God. Her unborn baby's been diagnosed with spina bifida. Is this your first baby? It's number four. Number four. So she's a bit of an expert. Jay and obstetrics consultant Lawrence Impey are giving Nicola an ultrasound. Do you see, yep. do you see it there? Yeah. I, I think that's what it is. There is splaying of the vertebrae above L5. Yeah. That's exactly what I was wondering. They think they may have seen a tumour on the baby's spine. The ultrasound scans that we've got today 